हेलो एवरीवन आई वेलकम यू ऑल टू फिजिक्स वाला चाय पी लो कहीं से स्वाद मिलेगा यही से सो आई वेलकम यू अगेन टू पी डब्ल्यू गर्ल्स चैनल सीबीएसई इज आउट विद इट्स नोटिफिकेशन फॉर आर्य बट्टा गणित चैलेंज 2023 राइट एंड आई एम हेयर टू गिव यू अ डिटेल अबाउट दिस पर्टिकुलर चैलेंज एंड इफ यू आर एन एस्पिरेंट राइट इफ यू आर एन एस्पिरेंट हु इज टारगेटिंग वेरियस कॉम्पिटेटिव एग्जाम्स लाइक आई आई और आई और KVPY, then this particular challenge is for you, right? In this particular lecture, I will give you each and every detail of this particular challenge. What exactly it is, right? And what is syllabus? What is eligibility, etc., etc. Each and every detail from zero to hero, right? I will be giving you each and every detail, right? So first of all, what is the target of this particular uh, session? I, I would be giving you details such as. About this exam, that is AGC, Arya Bhatta Ganit Challenge 2023. Right. I would be telling you about what is the eligibility of this exam, what is the syllabus of this exam, what are the different stages of this exam. Right. And finally, what is the process of registration? Right. Because that is the most important thing. Because if you register, then only you would be able to give this particular exam. Right. so first question that should arise in your mind is what exactly is agc what is aryabhatta ganit challenge uh, for which the cbsc has given the notification previously cbsc has organized this challenge right and that was quite successful in the previous edition to know about this exam first of all you would uh, you want to, you would be knowing what exactly this who was aryabhatta first of all let's talk about it right so aryabhatta you must have heard of this name previously right so aryabhatta was a scientist in the 5th century right one of the greatest mathematicians he was right the man who discovered zero right the man who found out the value of pi and also told that pi is an irrational number which was proved right in the 17th century right which was proved right in the 17th century and aryabhatta told that in the 5th century itself right so definitely he was a great scientist by the way one more uh, achievement he had a one more achievement right he calculated he told that earth rotates on its axis and he calculated that time period also that too with a high accuracy right so and in the 5th century right so now you must be realizing why this competition is being organized the purpose of this competition is that cbse central board of secondary education believe that there must be aryabhattas among you right one of the aryabhattas might be watching the video right so to find out like for to nurture those bright minds right cbs is organizing this competition that is aryabhatta ganit challenge ganit ganit means mathematics by the way right so i hope you must be uh, aware you must have got to know what this particular challenge is right now how this challenge would be organized first let's discuss that there would be two levels level 1 and level 2 right so the level 1 it would be organized in the school itself it would be a paper pen method that is the it would be over question paper it won't be over the computer based uh, it won't be a computer test uh, based uh, test right so level 1 would be a question paper based uh, test right and from the level 1 right of in a particular school uh, after the level 1 Three students would be shortlisted, and they were will be given. Uh, they are they would be asked to give level two of this particular exam, which would be computer based, right? So level one, it to uh, level one, it is the question paper uh, test, and the level two, it is the computer based. Now, what's the eligibility? So all the students from grade eight to grade ten. under the cbsc affiliate the schools affiliated to cbsc studying in the schools affiliated to cbsc are eligible to give this exam right now level 2 three students from each school selected for the after the first stage would be giving the level 2 in their school i will be telling you the process don't worry so this is the eligibility so if you are student from grade 8 to 10th that is 8 9 10 10 then you are eligible uh, eligible for this particular exam right now what would be the syllabus of this exam you must be wondering what is the syllabus of this exam so it would be your mathematics uh, which you have studied previously and it would be more of applied one 
राइट लाइक फॉर एग्जाम्पल इन द कॉन्टेंट पार्ट यू हैव एलजेब्रा नंबर सिस्टम दैट इज द रैशनल इ रैशनल राइट प्राइम कॉम्पोजिट दैट यू हैव स्टडीड नंबर सिस्टम वुड बी देयर एलजेब्रा वुड बी देयर मेन्जुरेशन वुड बी देयर राइट एंड ज्योमेट्री राइट एंड डेटा एनालिसिस एंड प्रोबेबिलिटी प्रोबेबिलिटी इज समथिंग दैट यू आर स्टडिंग फ्रॉम अ लॉन्ग टाइम राइट एंड क्वांटिटेटिव एप्टीट्यूड राइट क्वांटिटेटिव एप्टीट्यूड इंक्लूड्स नंबर ऑफ टॉपिक्स लाइक टाइम एंड वर्क टाइम स्पीड एंड डिस्टेंस क्यू ए दैट इज बाय द वे वन ऑफ माई फेवरेट टॉपिक ऑल्सो क्वांटिटेटिव एप्टीट्यूड राइट द कॉम्पिटेंसीज इंक्लूड लॉजिकल रीजनिंग बेसिकली आई नीड टू डिफाइन दिस पर्टिकुलर बॉक्स देन लॉजिकल रीजनिंग पार्ट लॉजिकल रीजनिंग में इंक्लूड ब्लड रिलेशन सिलोजिजम्स एट्सेट्रा राइट सो लॉजिकल एंड एनालिटिकल पार्ट वुड बी देयर राइट सम वुड बी स्ट्रैटेजिक वन सम वुड बी प्रॉब्लम सॉल्विंग स्किल्स वुड बी अंडरस्टैंड दिस इज कंप्लीटली बेस्ड ऑन लॉजिकल थिंकिंग दिस कंप्लीट पार्ट द क्रिएटिव पार्ट द विजुअलाइजेशन पार्ट एंड द कंसेप्चुअल अंडरस्टैंडिंग राइट सो दिस इज बेसिकली द कॉन्टेंट पार्ट राइट नाउ लेट सी वॉट इज द प्रोसेस ऑफ रजिस्टरिंग इन दिस पर्टिकुलर एग्जाम अच्छा बाय द वे वन मोर थिंग वन मोर थिंग दैट आई नीड टू टेल वॉट इज द वेटेज राइट सो प्रीवियसली देर वर फोर्टी क्वेश्चन राइट एंड ऑल वर मल्टीपल चॉइस एम सी क्यू बेस्ड राइट एंड एंड देर वॉज नो नेगेटिव मार्किंग देर वॉज नो नेगेटिव मार्किंग इन बोथ द लेवल in both the levels that is level 1 and level 2 both there was no negative marking and weightage was uh, 40 question and uh, 40 marks would be the weightage only this is this was the same uh, in the previous uh, part also now what would be the ta- what would be the time duration time duration would be 1 hour that is 60 minutes so 1 hour would be the time duration that is 60 minutes right so this is the weightage and the time duration right now what would be the, what is the process of this particular challenge like how should we how can we register for this exam whether we have to submit the forms offline or we have to submit to our schools what is the process right so the process is quite simple initially your school will have to apply at a particular link that is mentioned here by 25th of august 2023 that to up till 5:30 pm obviously uh, your school won't be waiting for the last date so make sure you ask your school uh, management or school authorities to register on the official link by this deadline that is 25th of august 5:30 pm right uh, and the time is according to indian standards time right so apply by 25th of august right and the school would be getting a uh, question paper along with the answer key in between 28th august to 5th of september 5th of september by the way is the <laughs> teachers day right hai na so the school would be getting a question paper right along with the answer key and it would be conducting the test in the school itself right and based on that school uh, based on that particular test right the school will identify top 3 students the school would be identifying top 3 students obviously the uh, students who would be scoring the best marks uh, of those of the students giving the exam the top 3 would be shortlisted for the next round now if there is a clash let us suppose five students got the same marks right all of us got the same marks now uh, will all five of us go in the next round answer is no right so the school itself would be conducting some screening round maybe some interview or some other test right and based on that only three students again would be shortlisted in case there is a uh, if uh, two uh, three or uh, more than three students get the same marks so school would be conducting that screening round right otherwise top 3 would be selecting and would be going in the next level right now before the level 2 that is the stage 2 the school is supposed to register again right and pay a uh, fees for rupees 900 by during 15th of september to 21st of september 2023 theek hai 
so the school then will be uh, like it would be given the link for the payment uh, that cbsc would be convey right then the c uh, then the school would be paying a fee of 900 rupees the first round is absolutely free of cost by the way there is no charges for the first round after the first round is done the school would be paying a fees of rupees 900 now you must be wondering if we are a student then do we have to pay that fees like 300 300 300 uh, what we say uh, country like we are doing a country no it is not like that the school would pay the fees of 900 right now after this is done the second round begins right so the second round begins uh, and the date of the and the second round would be the computer based as i told previously the complete test would be done over the computer based system right and it is on 3rd of october 2023 that is the next day of gandhi jayanti right so it would be conducting again in your school premises itself but it would be cbt computer based test right and uh, only for the students for class 8 to 10 as i told right now let us suppose the second round is also done now you must be wondering what are the prizes what would be the winners would be getting right that is the main thing you should have told in start right uh, so basically what happens is there are prizes or uh, i would say uh, prizes for student as well as the school itself right so the top 100 students from each region the top 100 students from each region each cbsc region they will be given a merit certificate no not the top 100 students among all students among each region for example gulf is one of the region of cbsc right there are other regions also that you can check out on their websites also right so among those top 100 students would be given a merit certificate and one more thing one more thing the top 10 schools having the maximum particip participation will get a certificate also the top 10 schools from each region having the maximum uh, student count will be getting a certificate also the schools will be also be getting certificate so if you have a school then this video is also important for you also you would be getting a certificate if you register yourself and your students at that cbsc portal right so basically this is all about this is all about the aryabhatta ganesh challenge i hope uh you must have liked this particular video and make sure make sure you give this particular exam this particular challenge reason being reason being somewhere these are the building even though like you are in 8th 9th or 10th you must be wondering i have to prepare for itj or some other olympiads later on why should i give this particular exam the reason is this particular exam or challenge it would be a building block it would be a building block for the next exam or maybe the exams that you would be giving in your future right so make sure you give this particular exam that is very important again reason is it is not only the goal that is important it is the journey that is important right so thank you very much keep studying 